Hey guys, I'm going to consider this lesson optional. If you understood how to make the room in the last lesson, then this one probably isn't going to be much of a surprise for you. All we're going to be doing in this lesson is making a bunch of corridor pieces. So if you want to skip ahead and see how it all comes together, that's perfectly fine. You probably won't miss anything. If you want to stick around, great. You might learn a trick or two. Alright, so all I'm doing here is just making a hallway. It's basically just going to be two sides, two walls. Okay, I'm going to move around to get a better view of the other side. Select these two pieces for the other wall. Rotate and duplicate. And there we go, there's our hallway piece. Let's just select these to make a group. And uh, you know what? There's a fine line between lazy and efficient. And I walk that line. I'm just gonna move that rotated corner piece over there before I make this a group. All right, there is our hallway piece. All right, now we're gonna do a four-way intersection. So we'll just grab these two corner pieces here duplicate and place them there and then move this one to the other side and then select this one again rotate and duplicate these two pieces for the other side and there we go get a better view here grab it by that corner and match it up with the floor at that corner there we go that's it All right, next up on the list is a three-way intersection. So we'll just grab a regular wall, drag it on down and snap it to the floor. Perfect. Uh, we are gonna need a corner. So we'll just grab that, duplicate, and snap it there. And uh, let's grab these two corners here out of there. Control-C to copy, and then Control-V to paste. And ta-da, done. There's our T intersection. Just select them all and turn them into a group. All right, the next one is a corner piece, and I'm sure you couldn't tell that by looking at it. So we'll just uh, duplicate this and put it there, rotate, and just bring it on around. Bingo. All right, we'll grab one of these corner pieces and just duplicate and put it right there whoops looks like i wasn't quite on the mark there so we'll just grab it and snap it into place perfect okay we're going to need one other corner piece let's just take this one put it there rotate and done okay before we turn this into a group this next piece is going to need a corner, so we'll just grab that. Now let's turn this into a group. Okay, done with the corner. Okay, let's mix things up and turn this into a utility closet. So let's grab the industrial pipe piece and place it there. Rotate and duplicate. And there. Okay, duplicate and move the duplicate piece to the end there. Okay, and then let's duplicate this again, and we'll rotate, and there we go. That is our dead end piece, and turn that into a group. Okay, real quick, I'm going to show you a neat little tool, and that's the zoom to extent. What this does is fit all of your objects into the window. Just click it, bam, done. Mm -hmm. 